This is the yarn I'm using. It's a category 4 yarn, so it's pretty thick. If you want your top to be thinner, you can go down to category 3 or 2. Make a slip knot. Chain up 33. Make a double crochet in the fourth chain from the hook. So you're gonna yarn over, insert hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two again. Then into the next stitch, one more double crochet. Keep repeating this to finish this row. The next row, chain two, chain your work. Again, in the fourth stitch from the hook. Work a double crochet. And then continue working double crochets. Don't miss the very last one. The next row, chain two again. Work two double crochets in these two stitches. Skip two double crochets, make a double crochet in the third stitch. Chain three. Then double crochet in the same stitch. Skip two again, double crochet in the third stitch. Work one double crochet in the following four stitches. Then we're going to make another space just like this one. Then skip two stitches. Work a double crochet in the next five stitches. Work the last three stitches at the end of this row.
for the next row, chain 2, work 2 double crochets, Then in this chain 3 space, make 5 double crochets. Then work 1 double crochet in these 5 double crochets of the last row. Then just continue doing this. Chain 2, from this point we're just gonna alternate between the last two rows. Then we're going to work the border 
I probably marked my straps too early. You can do this a bit later. So we're basically just gonna single crochet along this edge. Put two single crochets in each row. So keep putting single crochets. Ignore these straps for now. Work all the way back here. Slip stitch in the first single crochet. Chain one. Turn your work. And work this way. And when you're back here, mark your strap position. You'll probably need to try it on to see. So now I'm working my way back. So we're going to do the normal single crochet. When we see a stitch marker, we're going to work a strap. Start chaining before the stitch marker. I chained 50 here. Chain one more. Single crochet from the second stitch from the hook. This is the last single crochet before we started chaining. Insert a hook under the two loops on the left. Make a slip stitch. Then continue working single crochets from the next stitch. 